Plasun is leader in lighting and electrical test instruments. Hello everyone, this is Daisy. Let me introduce to you the use of the LS995556 automatic safety test system. The following is the video catalog. 1. Packing list. 2. Operation steps. 3. Do's and don'ts. Please check the packing list when you receive the shipment. The equipment and all the accessories are in one box. Accessories include, power cord, sample junction box, grounding clamp. There is also a plastic bag in the package that contains a CD, calibrate certificates, and guarantee cards. There are user manual, operation video, and related standards in the CD. Connect the power cord to the correct power source. Connect the correct stable voltage for your sample to the power terminals. Connect the correct stable leakage test voltage for your sample to the leak terminals. The leakage test voltage should be 1.06 times of the sample voltage according to the standard. For example, if your sample voltage is 220 volts, the leakage test voltage should be 234 volts. Connect the wires of junction box to these four terminals. Connect the sample to the junction box. Connect the clamp to the sample enclosure metal part. If the sample has grounding line, connect the wires of the grounding clamp to these two terminals. If the sample doesn't have a grounding line, change the wire from shell to ground. Turn on this sample power switch. Turn on the equipment. Move the cursor using the left and right keys. Change the test item using the up and down keys. Move the cursor to the values. Change the setting values using the up, down and number keys. The setting voltage for leakage test should be the same as the input voltage for leakage test, 234 volts. If the error between input voltage and set voltage exceeds 5 volts, the equipment will show error when you run the test. All the setting can be saved to a group number. And many groups can be saved. Move the cursor to page 1. Then you can start the test. Turn off this switch after the test. Then you can replace the sample or turn off the equipment. For safety reasons, do not touch the sample and wiring during the test. Thanks for watching.